Ant Eaters and welcome back to episode three of ATV's Hotspot, where we take you behind the scenes of all the coolest places to check out. I'm Keely. And I'm Leah. Today we are at Hironori Craft Ramen in Irvine just to check out some delicious ramen. Let's go and get started. Welcome back everyone. I am here with Hiro of Hironori Craft Ramen. I'm the owner of Hironori Craft Ramen. I'm the half of Hironori. 50%. 50%? Yeah. 50%? We're missing 50, the other half. I've been doing this for three years. We opened this uh, 2017 uh, April. But this is one of six locations, right? Yeah, this is the first location oh, of six. Okay, nice. Yeah. What makes Hironori one of the most, the best, best, best ramen to go to? We built the factory ramen factory in the early stage of the business. So we make everything over there, broth, noodle. So we are the only one who make everything by ourselves. Can you tell us a little about like how the ramen gets made, what's in it, in case anyone's unfamiliar? Uh, yeah, so like um, we import all the wheat from uh, Japan. Okay. Very high quality wheat. Um, the broth, we use lots of kind, different kind of uh, pork bones. We import the soy sauce from Japan. They've been doing it for 300 years. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh They're the one of the one of the oldest soy sauce factory in Japan. I personally heard that slurping ramen is the best way to eat it. Okay. Okay. What is your best way to eat the yeah, ramen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, the slurp the noodle, but um, same time you have to eat as fast as possible because oh, really? yeah, the, okay. the noodle is alive. Have you heard that? Yeah. You have it. It'll, I would say noodle uh, lifespan lifetime is like five minutes. You have to finish within five minutes. What are some other popular items that customers always buy? I would say pork bun, crispy rice with spicy tuna, of course. We have a popular uh, drinks too, like boba, matcha latte. What are the most popular dishes we'll be trying today then? Today? Tonkotsu, the first one. The classic? Yeah, classic the, uh, with uh, pork broth. And uh, I would say vegan ramen, which is like uh, one of, one of our signature. So thank you so much for, com for coming out today. I know it was a little hectic at the beginning, but we really appreciate it. And we're looking forward to yeah. for your guys' next next location too. Hopefully there's another one in San Diego. Maybe yeah, a little yeah. one closer to my house. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry? The reason that we got, we are like really successful. I told you um, that's because we are the only one who make the noodle, broth, sauce, everything by ourselves. But also our amazing staff. Um, that um, most of them are like UCI Irvine students. UC Irvine students. They're like friendly, smart, quick. Um, I yeah, I really appreciate. Without their, their hard work, um, we couldn't uh, establish. Um, yeah. They're also the backbone of this place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so we're now back with this amazing, delicious meal right in front of us. For starting, we have the pork rinds with pickled onion. We have another plate of beautiful ramen, takonatsu pork with the eggs and a side of seaweed in there. This one right here is the ramen with, we have a lot of corn, broccoli, and for the protein, we have tofu right here. As Vegan well. ramen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's start. Okay. These have been looking at me the entire time. Oh, it's so soft. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. It's like super sweet, but then you get like a little bit of the, like, the crunch from the pickled onion, and so it's like perfect. Now this is what I'm excited about. Even though this is the vegan dish, we are having the same noodles because he doesn't even use egg. Mm -hmm. There goes nothing. Oh, look at that, okay, okay. Oh yeah. <laughs> These are so good. Got some pork. The pork is like when you like get meat to that like perfect consistency where it's like butter tender. almost. It's super tender. The broth is balls. honestly delicious. It's such like a beautiful creamy color. The broth is like super light. I thought it was gonna be a little heavier since yeah. it looks creamy. It's so good. 
that broccoli? A Literally a whole stock, and I'm not even complaining. I needed some veggies in my diet too. This was a good call. Final take on the food. You should definitely come here. This is the greatest yeah. ramen I've ever had. <laughs> Overall, 10 out of 10. Highly recommend. If you're nearby my, um, Irvine, you gotta stop by. I will probably be back here for the next five weeks. Sounds about right. So, Katie, what was your favorite part of yesterday? Probably everything. <laughs> everything. Agreed. The pork buns and the ramen. It was just so good. I highly, highly recommend you check out the Hiranori here on Michelson Drive in Irvine or any of the other locations. You got six other to choose oh, yeah. from. <laughs> Try them all. <laughs> so that wraps up this third episode of Hot Spots. Be sure to go ahead and comment. Let us know what you guys want to see next. And until then, bye guys. Take bye. care.